Kia Serato looks quite modern despite the fact that its release has long been discontinued. Yes, and with reliability, as we found out, everything is more or less in order with him. Let's start with the engines, of which only two were provided for the car. Both gasoline, with a volume of 1.6 liters, 126 horsepower, and 2.0 liters, 150 horsepower. The base unit is considered the most massive for the used Cerato. 1.6 liter modifications account for up to 70 to 75 percent of offers in the secondary market. This motor turned out to be the most problematic. On some specimens, for example, the liners were turning, there was an increased appetite for engine oil. Due to a defective tensioner, after 70,000 km, the timing chain could stretch. Around the same time, there were problems with the catalyst. Not only is it quite expensive, in this condition it can also destroy the engine. The fact is that the porcelain cells of the converter are destroyed and their solid remains are sucked back into the bowels of the motor, destroying its cylinder piston group, but with the 2.0 liter 4 there are much fewer problems, even though it is more conservative in design. The cylinder block is made of cast iron and there is no variable valve timing system. In addition, the engine perfectly digests the 90 second gasoline. And he has practically no congenital sores. Gearboxes are also not burdened with problems, especially mechanical ones. Although automatic boxes are considered problem-free, the key to their longevity is a regular oil change after 60,000 km. Moreover, it is desirable to produce it with a filter change. It is also necessary to monitor the condition of the CV joint anthers. Worn and worn out rubber covers should be replaced immediately. Otherwise, you will have to spend money on the grenades themselves. In the suspension, the rear springs and shock absorbers can be called a pitfall. It would seem that in the rear suspension with a semi-independent twisting beam, there is nothing special to break. It's all about the wrong settings of these vibration dampers, which is why the car after 120 km, H begins to behave inappropriately. The stern throws up on bumps, besides, it starts to shy away from the sides, and with a set speed, all these liberties only intensify. The owners solve the problem by installing other springs and shock absorbers. As for the body, it should be noted a weak paintwork and the metal itself is thin and susceptible to corrosion. A sedan can be chipped anywhere, from the thresholds and wheel arches to the roof and pillars of the body. Summing up, we can say that the Kia Cerato is generally reliable, and only the 1.6-liter engine is at risk. There are no problems with gearboxes a priori. At the mechanics only after 150,000 km, the linkage of the lever can loosen. Both machines, until 2010, a four-speed automatic transmission was installed on the sedan after which they began to install a more modern six-band, they are durable. The key to their long life is regular oil changes along with the filter. Of the two fours installed on the Cerato, the 2.0 liter is considered the most trouble-free. Although the base engine with a volume of 1.6 liters is marked by whims and failures, not at all on every instance. According to statistics, about half of the owners of used Cerato did not encounter the above problems. The main thing is to change the oil in the engines more often. Stabilizer struts serve from 40,000 to 90,000 km. Around the same time, sounds similar to the vibrations of a loose spring, when the steering wheel is turned, will herald the death of the strut support bearings. Wheel bearings are updated for 20,000 km. Although there are those who change them only after 70,000 km. The paintwork of Cerato is frail, and the metal itself is not strong enough and resistant to corrosion. Moreover, a sedan can become chipped anywhere, from traditional sills and wheel arches to the roof and pillars. Most of all goes to the roof, which is not initially protected from rust. It may blister after two to three winters. From the vagaries of electrical equipment, official and specialized services get. The power windows and the central lock are buggy. The multimedia system and climate control can spontaneously turn on and live their own lives. Fortunately, these electrical failures are not widespread and do not pull on statistics. 